look what I have in my hands right now. It's an advanced reader copy of Nothing Like the Movies by Lean Painter. Hello everyone, welcome to the Ultimate Guide to the Better Than Movie series, also known as the Liz Woods Universe. This is so exciting, I've been wanting to make this video for a long time and in honor of the last book of the series releasing Shirley, here I am. This will be a non-spoiler video for the people who haven't read this series yet and want to get into it. This series is by Lynn Painter, an amazing rom-com author. She writes both YA and adult novels. The Better Than The Movies series are completely YA, so if you're expecting just even the minimum bit of a spice, maybe this is in the right place. The Lisboa's universe is made up of five books, two full-length novels that are Better Than The Movies and Nothing Like The Movies, and three novellas that are Better Than Before, Better Than The Prom and Nothing Better Than You. I had the pleasure to meet Lynn Painter at a signing back in June this year, and apart from her being beyond sweet, I got to ask her about nothing like the movies and told her about how scared I was for Liz and Wes not having their happy ending and she literally said to me, everything will be okay. And I really needed to hear that. Anyway, the first book in the Liz Wes universe is Better Than Before. This book has as a prequel to both Better Than the Movies and Better Than You. Better Than You is another book by Lynn Painter which we will not be talking about because even though one of the main characters is Wes Scosting, it's not that relevant in the Liz West universe. Anyway, better than before, it has multiple POVs. On one hand, we have Liz and Wes's POVs, and on the other, we have Bailey and Charlie's POVs. Better than before is a novella of like 40 pages more or less, and it's about Charlie and Bailey meeting on a flight. And when they arrive to the destination, Charlie gets picked up at the airport by his cousin Wes, who introduces him to Liz. Better Than The Movies and Better Than You are two different books. They have nothing to do with each other. Better Than Before just collides the two novels. And if you like Charlie and Bailey's part of this novella, just read their own book too, because why not? By the way, all the novellas in this series are available to read for free on a page called Simon Teen. I'll leave all the links in the description. Okay, Better Than The Movies is the first book that was released in this universe. The one that started it all. This book is fully narrated by Liz only and it follows Liz, who wants to catch the attention of her long-time crush and will do anything for it. So she ends up teaming up with Wes, her neighbor. But soon as Liz and Wes work together, she starts to realize she enjoys his company and might actually like Wes more than she expected and begins to rethink her ideas about love. This book is a childhood frenemies to lovers romance with fake dating, slow burn, and a lot of banter and cheesy vibes. The whole book happens around their senior year of high school, and it's just the kind of book that gets better with every read. Following up, we have Better Than The Prom and Nothing Better Than You. Better Than The Prom is another novella which has like 30 East pages. This book basically describes the promise scene that happens in Better Than The Movies, but this time from West's POV. Here we get to see how Wes feels about Liz going to prom with another guy. Nothing Better Than You is the next novella. It's also another scene from Better Than the Movies from Wes's POV and it describes his first kiss with Liz. It doesn't matter the order in which you read these two novellas. I'd rather read Nothing Better Than You first than Better Than the Prom because that's the order these scenes happen in Better Than The Movies, but it's irrelevant and it's a no-brainer. Honestly, in my opinion, the novellas in the series are what makes the series a lot better, like getting to know what's his thoughts at the time those scenes were happening is everything. He is just so obsessed with her, down bad, barking up the gym or whatever Taylor Swift said. And at last, we have Nothing Like The Movies, the sequel to Better Than The Movies. Getting an arc for this novel was like a dream come true. This book follows Wes and Liz, who were once together and in love, but just as they were about to start a new life in college, they broke up. Now, Wes is determined to win Liz back with big romantic gestures, but she isn't easily convinced, leaving him to wonder if they are truly over. At the beginning of the book, Wes is in a really dark mental state, so he decides to end things with Liz, so he doesn't bring her down with him. Was the secure will it that necessary? I don't know, but I'm just a girly who loves second chance romances and sue me, but I enjoy the miscommunication trope as well. And to be honest, I'll take any Liz West I can get. 
This book is a second chance college romance with a slow burn, long enough banter, and it's the well POV. Also, content warning, this book deals with sensitive issues like grief, PSD, and anxiety. And that is all about the Lisbeth's universe. So to sum up, I'm gonna leave the reading order somewhere here in case you want to screenshot it. We have Veranda Me Four, First Novella, Prequel to Both, Veranda Movies, and Veranda On You. Veranda Movies, first full length book, it has a high school setting. Liz wants her long-term crush to ask her for prom, and Wes helps her to get his attention. Nothing Better Than You and Better Than the Prom, the next two novellas, it doesn't matter the order in which you read these two, they are both two scenes from Better Than the Movies, but from Wes's POV. And Nothing Like the Movies, final installment in the series, Wes and Liz broke up, now they're in college, and Wes wants to get Liz back. So, if you've come this far, thank you so much for watching, I hope I've convinced you to give this series a shot, because it is worth it, and I hope you enjoyed this video, and don't forget to subscribe and to follow me on all my socials. We'll see each other on the next one.